You have to wear gloves during the synthesis. Silver nitrate is corrosive and stains the skin. Sodium chloride is extremely toxic. Just kidding about sodium chloride. Ha 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 ha. For this synthesis you will need silver nitrate and sodium chloride, which is table salt. Here is the silver nitrate. Make an aqueous solution of silver nitrate by dissolving two spoons of silver nitrate into 50 milliliters of water. Just do the same with the sodium chloride. I used about three spoons. Add into the silver nitrate solution the sodium chloride solution. When you are adding the sodium chloride solution, you will see white clouds appear. This is the silver chloride. This is the reaction. Silver nitrate plus sodium chloride gives sodium nitrate and silver chloride. You have to filter the solution to get the silver chloride and the sodium nitrate solution. Here is the sodium nitrate solution, which is about 75 milliliters. Let me take the silver chloride, which I haven't filtered, but which remained in the container. This is a nice amount of silver chloride, if you look how much chemical we used. Here is the filtered silver chloride. That's about it. To get the sodium nitrate crystals, you have to evaporate of the water, this can take several days. Let the silver chloride dry in a dark place. I'll show both results in an upcoming video. So please, comment, rate and subscribe for more chemistry.